if you're 14, 15, 16, and your main focus is losing fat, and you're not genuinely obese, you're focusing on the wrong thing. You have to be focusing on shutting the fuck up and going to the gym. Your focus isn't losing fat. It's gaining muscle. If you want to look better, you could lose the fat, but it's going to take a while and you're just going to be ending you're going to end up looking like a like a skinny little fragile. It's not worth it. Go to the gym. Shut the fuck up about going on a cut and losing weight and I'm fat. You don't deserve to be lean. Your cons- your choices throughout life have led you to where you look, what you look like today. Don't go on a don't go on a cut for your first two to three years of lifting. Throughout the first two to three years, you're bulking, you're eating. If you're fat, you're not fat. When the sun's out, go shirtless and see your shadow. Is your shadow like round? No, it's flat. It's like a stick. You're not fat. I'll show you what fat looks like. Give me a second. All right. If you're looking like this, and around 14, 15, 16, you should focus on losing fat because it's so, I don't want to be insulting, but like it's affecting your health. You know what I'm saying? You go to the doctor, they tell you you're obese. This is where you need to go on a cut. But when you're like, let me show you an example. Hold up. If you're looking like this, this is skinny fat. You see, he has a little bit of chub right here. No visible abs. He doesn't have veins. His arms are kind of skinny, so he looks weird. His stomach bulges out when he wears a tight shirt. If you look like this, don't focus on losing fat. If you actually cared about improving your physical attractiveness, like your body, if you want to look better, go to the gym and eat more. Because, let me show you an example. Okay, this is probably most guys' dream body. Maybe a little bigger than that, maybe a little smaller than this, but this is, you know, visible abs, you got the veins, you got some beefy chest, big ass shoulders, you look big, you look great. This is achieved by bulking. You have to look big and you have to go to the gym before you can look like this. If you look like this and you lose fat, you're not gonna look like this. You're gonna just look like some fucking wanky at. It's not worth it, guys. If you actually cared, you would shut the fuck up and you would go to the gym. To get to this point, you have to look like this. See this guy? He's bloated. He's kind of fat. He looks like this picture, but he's been going to the gym. Now, this is gonna take a while. It's gonna take a year or two years. That's why I said, don't go on a cut for the first couple of years you're lifting because you're your goal isn't to lose fat. It's to get bigger. Once you're bigger, you cut down during winter time or no summertime. And then you look like this and you look like this. If this is your body type, shut the fuck up about I need to lose weight. I'm fat. You deserve to be fat. You know what I'm saying? Guys at my school would come up to me, come up to me and not to be insulting, their body type looks like this. And th- one guy, I want to say his name. Let's call him mm, Alberto. Alberto comes up to me. Or doesn't come up to me, but I hear about his plans to get his physique looking better. He's going on a 1,200 calorie deficit when he's supposed to be eating 2300 so getting down on 1100 calories isn't gonna be sufficient if you're working if you're like living your life with half of the calorie calories are energy if you're going throughout your day half of the energy you're gonna feel like shit and it's not even it's not worth it don't focus on losing fat Get in the gym and eat more. You want to eat more because the more calories you eat, the more amount of muscle you build. If you ever talk to someone who's actually experienced with like cutting, bulking, and lifting weights, when they're on cuts, you cannot build, like it's really fucking hard to build muscle because you're purposely eating less calories so that you lose your fat. 
when you're eating less calories, you have less energy to move weights. You're not going to gain that much muscle on a cut. There's no such thing as losing muscle and gaining fat at the same, or gaining muscle and losing fat at the same time. When you're 14 and 15, shut the fuck up about losing weight, get in the gym and eat more. You want to get bigger. You want to weigh more. That doesn't mean get fatter. It just means get bigger. Bigger muscles, a slight bit of, you might even, you might even have like the same amount of fat on your body, even though you're eating more because you're eating more and the extra calories is not in fat. The extra calories is in power in the gym. You don't gain fat when you're bulking and going to the gym. When you're eating more, you get fat, but you're going to the gym as well. You're going to gain muscle and not lose that much fat. I hope what I'm saying, I'm, I hope what I've said has made sense. If you look like this and you want to look like this, you have to look like the picture on the left. To look like on the pic, like, to, to look like this picture right here, you have to shut the fuck up, go in the gym, and eat more. If you look like this, your health is in concern and you gotta you know what i'm saying you gotta get on the ball you gotta eat less move more but if you look like this you already know what to do by now if you really cared about improving how you look you would eat more and get into the gym i've said this so many times in this video everyone needs to fucking bulk you're 13 14 15 16 17 you're in high school middle school even bulk if you want to act if you actually cared you would eat more because you're getting bigger then you cut down later after a couple of years because this shit takes time i don't want to get too big is that's the fucking lamest fucking excuse you're not gonna get too big to the point where you don't like it after the first four fucking years of lifting weights oh i can't afford the gym a gym membership is like 40 40 to $50 a month. That's less than $2 a day. Homeless people can come up with more than that amount. Homeless people with no phones, no extra money, no parents, no fucking house, they could come up with that money. And if you're like a kid, you don't have much, you don't have bills to pay and got rent. I sound like your mom, but like, come on. You won't got none, you got nothing to spend money on. Spend your money on something that'll give you muscle, man. Go to the gym. Shut the fuck up. All of that is just excuses, guys. Most people, when they're confronted with a solution like I'm giving you right now, they're either making excuses or they're like, you're right. Which one is going to be more successful? Which one's going to have a better physique? The person who comes up with excuses on the spot, I don't got money, I'm not trying to get too big. Or the person who's like, you know, this guy makes fucking sense. You know, I'm going to follow what this guy says. Which one are you going to be? Get the fuck together, man. Get to the gym. What?